Welcome back to Anderton's TV, everybody. I'm with Danish Pete today. Now you may know Danish Pete as, uh, <laughs> you know, a, a YouTube superstar from Anderton's TV. Wow, but, no. Uh, but um, wow. prior to that, Mr. Pete, you used to gig, didn't you? Oh, you did. In like proper bands. Well, in um, bands. Hired guns, as they say. He was a hired gun. And today's- Sideman, don't to say hired gun. That might not be appropriate in all countries. Start again? He was a extremely successful touring guitar player, uh, playing some not insignificant sized arenas or anything, were you? No. Um, um, and as we're choosing your <laughs> rig today, I want, very, to, yeah. <coughs> I want very... to take you back. I want, you want to take me back? Yes, you, um, you are driving to which gig? We, Tom Jones? A Tom Jones gig? Yeah. Well, I won't be driving then, will I? I'll just be in, in the bus somewhere. Well, no, this is a different... You are is it driving. This scenario? Okay. Yeah, this so, is, you're so... driving to a Tom Jones gig. Okay. It's not one of the bigger, like, 100,000-seater gigs. It's a private party <laughs> Was it? Yeah, okay. uh, for um, an okay. extremely wealthy member of, you know, some royal family yeah. from somewhere around the world. Yeah, yeah. And uh, in, the bo in the boot of your car is your... My uh, rig. Is your rig. My rig. But someone's just driven up the back of the car, destroyed... Everything. Your purple telly's gone. Oh, your victory amplifiers in bits. Your pedal board is just now it's just like smashed it's in smashed half. Bits. But fortunately, the van, the accident happened right, right outside, outside Anderson's, Anderson's, and you got a thousand pounds. So I'm in Guildford somewhere with yeah. some celebrity in Guildford. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you got a uh, thousand Clapton. pounds in your wallet. Okay. And you got to run into Anderson's. Oh, have I? Wow. And replace <laughs> uh, your. The rig. for your Tom Jones yeah. gig. I only have a thousand. That's it. Thousand pounds. That's okay. the maximum, that uh, including the uh, And so that's it. We, you got it. You got to run in. You got twenty minutes to basically choose what you want. Get back in the car. Yeah. Get to the gig. Um, I think this gig. <laughs> and Ky that's... Kylie Minogue is playing as well. So it's a big Cossius. gig. Yeah. Um, so it's like a birthday party for birthday some. Birthday party uh, for some, some. So there'll be lots of <clears throat> Prince William. And I have to make sure like that. that it sounds good. But there will be. There will be. You know, there'll be a, a, a sound guy there and some stuff, to, yes. so they'll mic it up. So yeah. I don't have to have like. Yeah. It's not like okay, fine, okay. Well, I need a, I need a, a, a tea style. Who's that guy dressed up as a reindeer? I don't know. He's, uh, <laughs> you don't know what he's what he's doing on there, but um, well, you know, tea style all day long. But I got a thousand pounds, so we go to guitars here, right? Electric guitars. Electric guitars. Electric, Electric guitars. guitars. So you're gonna go. T -star. Now, obviously, if you pick Telecaster, it's only going to show Fender Telecasters. Yeah. But so, you, you've got an idea. So you've got, actually, before so, we get into this, £1,000. Yeah. Now, when we've done this with other guests before, yeah. they've all gone, they've spent the lion's share of the money on the guitar amplifier. Yeah. And then basically almost found like the cheapest viable electric guitar that they yeah. can find. Now, when we were talking about this before, that didn't necessarily sound like the route that you were going to go down. Uh, I get. I, I I would prefer always. I think there's most most more important to have a really good amp than a, a super good guitar mm -hmm. because there is a per, there's a um, what's it called law of diminishing returns. At some point, the guitar is you pay for little bits and pieces and and you know mm -hmm. names and brands and all that stuff. Um, and it, I probably would for for what I need. Mm -hmm. I need a clean platform that's relatively loud. And then I want to build that up with some pedals of some okay. sort. So I thought for this gig, <laughs> I'm thinking having something similar price guitar ramp and then see where we get to with the with the pedals. So I've got a little bit of well, give us a, give, what, I think the best way to do this is put the price bracket in that you okay. think you want to choose. So a price, guitar. I would say three to four hundred quid. I say so you're going quite a bit more expensive you know the the other guys have all been in the almost like the sort of two to three hundred okay so it's not a million miles I, off it's not it? a million miles off i think you know we can see what we got here on the two to three hundred mm -hmm. as well just and we better because, pick the old show in stock because yeah because now it's there well you, your gig's in literally an hour's time yeah so, so i need to see what's in here oh we've got left-handed telecasters there purple metallic um see so i should just pick one of those shouldn't i really but you know tradition classic but i mean why wouldn't you? Do you want to? Do you want? To? You can have more than one guitar, by the way, in the room to just sort of check. So, do you want yeah. one of those? If we, if a... it's, if it's, if it's, if it's here, why not? There is, there is. Okay, the so here. we could go purple. I mean, that's your signature it's the, look. It's the right? thing, isn't so it? We got, we've got a purple classic vibe. Is yeah. one option. And I then, 
that purple shall I put it? Shall there? I put it in the? In you can the, put it in the basket. Absolutely. Basket. It puts in it basket. in the basket. Excellent. Puts it in the basket. Um, let's scroll through here. So I'm looking for tea style kind of things. So and we did the video the other day on uh, oh, many many pages here. As many many we? pages. Oh. But let's see. You're talking about the video we did on Sires S3, yes. aren't we? Yeah, because okay. that's the same price. T3 even. Sorry. T3. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, so what have you got choices there? Guitars was blue, sunburst, white. I thought they did a red one, didn't they? But yeah, anyway. but I like this one here. You Ooh. see. Go on then. Add that to yeah, the basket. So is, is that's that's identical it. price. Pretty much. Yeah, identical price. I yeah. think, isn't it? Interesting. Okay. So that's that's a that's a definitely so a shootout. Just, I mean, one is one is rosewood, and one is maple. So you're, I mean, do you you're not going to consider. Any, it's just tea style. That's it. You don't. Because I know what I can do with yes. it, Matt. You know, it's so familiar to me, I mean, and I can play. It's not unusual. Yeah. I can do. You know, she's, she's a lady. Sex, <laughs> sex bomb. Um, I can get it yes, all from that telecast. Okay, fine. So we got a couple of guitars there, and, yeah. and I think, in all fairness, look. You know, we know you're a you're a telecaster fan. So so there we go. We yeah. Got a couple of guitars. And then I'm I'm um, you know, I'm secure. Right. Mm. What do you want? So that's three sixty nine. So you've got six hundred and forty one pounds yeah. left to spend. Yeah. Uh, out of which you need to buy a guitar amplifier and, and some, some and pedals, pedals, right? Yeah. Okay. So what amps are you? I mean, I mean if you're going to go tube, your tube valve, whichever you know, you say tomato, I yeah. say tomato. Um, you're going to use up the bulk of that six hundred pounds, I would imagine. Yeah. So what do you think? So I, that's why I'm not going to do that. Dun, dun, dun. He's think, not going valve, ladies and gentlemen. No, blasphemy. Yeah, yes, blasphemy, blasphemy. Absolutely. Because I think if I'm... <laughs> Bring in the Spanish Inquisition. <laughs> Kill him. <laughs> if I'm going... If I go... I think if I go valve, I don't think I will get something that is clean platformly enough for that amount of money. Does that make sense? Yes, clean, you're, you're going to end up with something at sort of ten or twenty watts. Yeah, and it's not and and, have it, a lot and of it's headroom. just and and I need that clean. I need wow. that clean base of it that just sits wow. underneath. I so know. It, I mean, so I'm thinking katana man. I'm going out there on the limb. So predictable. It is predictable, but nobody else has picked it yet because this it is, is predictable. I mean, there's... Okay. Uh, um, well, let's have a look at... Uh, let's have a look at guitar amplifiers in the three to four hundred pound... Yeah, let's see what there is. And might, hey, there might be some... There might be some, you know, like the Bulgara 22, but, you know, it is there. This is true. It is there. Where do I click? Amps. Amps. Electric guitar amps. Co you're going to... Uh, presumably, you want a combo, right? Well, yeah, you know... Oh. Let's see, it's price. I think three to four hundred. Three to four hundred. Yeah, and in stock. And in stock. In stock. View 43. Yeah, I see the Bukeras there. They cost the same as the guitars, man. That's crazy good value, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, but I'm thinking I need... I need a dollar. A, I need dollar. a dollar, dollar. A dollar is, is all, all I, I need. need. Uh, See, I was I, w I was thinking about getting two katanas, one hundred. You can d do them together and then use all two, the two two fifty watts. No, because they can't link them up. Yeah, but you could. Have and it's three hundred quid output. anyway. True. So then you 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 know. Right. So there's only twelve in stock exactly. at that That's price. Why I so you, you need. I can buy six. Uh... <laughs> you can have a THR ten <laughs> and mic it up. Uh, you could go the Catalyst, which is what Nick Jennison uh, yeah, so chose that, the other so day. That was sounding good. It's a great amp, man. It's a good amp, but I don't think it takes pedals as well as the Katana because the Katana has got. I mean, this is my, it's my opinion, man. It you is, know? and it's got it. because it's got a analog front end in it that that so does well with the pedals. In here. And the Bugera was really good, but it didn't Pro again Junior. take the the pedals as well. The Pro Junior is way too small. Way too small. Yeah. I mean, there's really only two amps, and they're the top two there, aren't they? It's, yeah. You've got to go either Bugera or um, we could try that. We could have a Bugera and a Katana, and you could choose whichever one you felt you liked the best. We can do. I mean, I, I you're, absolutely you're pretty set on the Katana, aren't you? I'm just I know that amp. You know, I know mm. that amp, and if I am going, if it's like, oh God, I need a rig right now. I, I've I've gigged the katana before. Katana, I know what it sounds let's, like. I know what it does. Katana one hundred then. And I know I can go into the EQ and why fiddle. the why the one hundred as opposed to the fifty? Because it's just more, isn't it? Because it's just more. Slightly yeah. bigger cabinet. Slightly bigger uh, cabinet. Slightly louder, and uh, it takes pedals better. Yeah. Um, and I've gigged one of these before, and I know it works. So I think takes be pedals better. It was a throwaway comment there. It takes pedals the same, presumably, as the fifty, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Well. Yes, I, I, I meant then the Bugera. I thought when we did the video that the Bugera, there was some. It sounded great, but mm. it was something with I the liked pedals. The, I tell you what, I didn't 
I thought the clean sound on the Bagheera was spectacular. It was the, yeah, dri the driven sound on the Bagheera was a little bit de la fizz. Yeah, but if you're exactly. using pedals, all right. Well, look. Yeah. So you've got now. B49. So you've now breached the 700 mark. Yeah. So by about 20 quid, I think. So yeah. you've got uh, 280 pounds yeah. left to spend on pedals. That's mm -hmm. not a bad budget. Where are you that's what go? I mean. So I would like. I would like. I would like. I need a delay. A lot of chocolate on my biscuit. Uh, he needs a delay. Okay, why aren't you then just going to buy the foot controller for the katana? And because it's too fiddly. I've got, I've got no time to do this. You've got no time. I need to go sound in and, check and in edit. half an hour. Yeah, yeah. Sound check. You know, I need to eat before. Absolutely. I need to go to catering. <laughs> I need to give the gear to to, to somebody who can set okay. it up for me. Fine, understand. You know, so we're not going. So the, although you could program in presets and stuff from the katana, you yeah. just haven't got time. It's I'm not going to do that. Yeah. We're just, I'm not going to do that. We just need to be there for um, a good load in my own bah, preset. Bah, bah, yeah. bah, it's just bah, as Pete bah, runs bah, on, bah, puts bah, his guitar amp down and just yeah, does it. Yeah. So okay. I, I'm, I'm, so I did have a little bit of think this morning about that, <clears throat> and um, we did a video on the um, uh, tone. Was it Tone City? No. no. Yeah. Well, yes, Tone City. That's I'm probably going Tone City. You know, it's it is what it is. But I mean, the Durple definitely getting a Durple. Getting a Durple. So we're not doing a Dane then. You don't think you can afford to? So if I get the Dane, then I've spent most of the budget. Oh, that's all. Because fact, that's it's two hundred sixty. Okay. And so, and I think I would do that, but then I'm kind of limited. I won't have a delay. I need a wah pedal for sex bomb, you know, I need a little bit of wah, 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 wah. I need some of that stuff. So Okay, so Durpal, which is our affordable Pete Hanore sound in a little purple pedal. Yeah. And then so oh, what I like forty five so, quid. Yeah, so so I'll stick that in and here stick that in there. Yeah. And then we did this video the other day on the uh, King of We did. Blues. blues. Right? Because we are gonna play some blues sounds here. Now that that was a hilarious blues, video where yeah. it sounded basically identical to a King of Tone, but yeah. this is only seventy quid. And okay. it's got two, and it's got two overdrive sounds in it. So which means I've got a low gain, a mid gain, and a and, and, and a higher gain to mix up here. Okay. Uh, There's a lot of thought gone into this, Pete. No, I'm just. Um, it's just a. It's just. I think I know what I kind of need to where I can do everything. Yeah. So then I thought. I need a delay. Oh. Need a delay. See, that's too much money because I want to save oh, every little bit yeah. I need, but I don't really need a tap tempo on this. I've but not, we've not tried this exactly. yet. Exactly. TC Bucket Brigade. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And that's the that is kind of an old fashioned small, you know, and it's got a little bit of a mud switch, so it'll have some. And what is that? Some, is that because I've not seen this before? So this is and it's got the modulator. This is like a proper old fashioned Bucket Brigade chip, is yeah. it? In a delay pedal. Yeah. Ooh. And it's 59 quid. quid. Yeah. So what? Okay, I know this is a bit misleading because 369 yeah. of that is another but let's, guitar. Let's just, so you've, you've got let's about another hundred pounds to spend, haven't you? Yeah. So let's just take let's take this out, purple out. Okay. Just so that we can just keep so a we can keep it running the, total um, on it because they're the same money. So yeah. and I get two when I buy two um, two Tone City pedals, you get free power supply and free uh, daisy chain thing, exactly. don't you? Yes. So that's Shout. there, right? And I've earned, earned uh, loyalty points. <laughs> Eight ninety two. That's more than you get and pay for the gig. Absolutely, <laughs> I don't get paid anything. I just I get to pay my own petrol. Uh, so, so I've got what left here? Hundred and hundred and ten. Yeah, let's call it hundred and ten. Let's call it hundred and ten. Have you put the? Did you put the delay pedal in? Yeah. Wow, this is a good rig for. Yeah, and I'm not done yet, man. Because I've I'm, I was I was having a you know drove in this morning. I was thinking, what do I need? So I need I want a little chorus thing for some of the little uh, mm -hmm. just a little. So I'm going angel. Wow, uh, it's, angle it's wing. the winner of so many chorus shootouts, isn't it? Exactly. I agree. And it's super affordable. The angle, angle, angle wing. wing uh, uh, so we'll add that to the basket. Okay, 45, 49. It's gone up five pounds. Yeah, that's done, yeah. And then I need a wah pedal. Not a one pedal. A wah pedal. Now. So this is, this is where where we need to it's gotta go super cheap for super this, cheap pedal, for this one sub 50 quid yeah so hang on are we gonna we'll just go shop low to high. high yeah i'm a low to high kind of guy it's got to be yeah it's got to be that hell one, babe it? the hell babe hell babe <laughs> wow i mean it's what you it's what you get but i think i'm gonna run six pound 94 over 
but that's fine. I will will allow you to cash in your loyalty points in advance, or whatever, or we'll just because I've got we'll you just know, accept that we've got to give you a seven pound discount because you yeah. work here. So it's your staff discount. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is some rig. I mean, so what you got is, I mean, I could potentially do without the derp with, with the with the derpel, but it's nice to have no, I, it's when fine. you know when because you can get some proper gain tones. Now, so we're your, six quid over. The good news is your bag of cables survived the crash. Yeah, because that was so a, you don't was, need that. That was on the side you, next to me. Wasn't you're it? not going wireless or anything like that. It's not a massive gig. Um, no, no, no. I'm and, in the background in the dark. Anyway, yeah. uh, let's let's so, let's just put this rig together yeah. and, and let's play some classic old. <laughs> Tom, Tom Jones, Jones songs. songs, ready? Yeah. Anyway, uh, as if by magic, uh, mm -hmm. this gear, along with the purple Squire telly, because yes, I kind of yes, think yes. we should yeah, compare we, it, we will appear it. in yeah. three, two, one. Ah, yes! Right, well done. In record time, you've literally got five minutes left, Pete, before the gig. So, um, Take about half an hour to drive there. <laughs> we've set both amplifiers up here with an AB switch, so yeah. we can see. Um, set them both to a clean sound, so the, the Bugera is a relatively conventional two-channel amplifier we've got it set to its clean setting yeah you guys probably know the katana's got heaps of settings but we've got it on its yeah. clean sound yeah um one of the rules for gigging rig for under a thousand pounds is that it has to achieve a certain volume on the decibel meter so if we're not hitting kind of 95 db and upwards we're kind of going is it really gigable? yeah yeah but we are it will be mic'd up though you know this is true so, but pedals on the floor pedals uh, on the floor we've got a, a the behringer hell babe uh, Tone City King of Blues, into the Durple, into the Angel Wing, into the TC Bucket Brigade, yeah. into the Switcher. We yeah. also have this very diddy looking alternative wah wah yeah. in case Pete doesn't like the bearing. Yeah, there. and it's got a volume as well. So, uh, yes. Got two um, guitars? Well, we've got three guitars. Well, you see, this one got completely damaged oh, and that's destroyed. Where the, that's where the uh, thing got hit in the boot. Look, isn't it? it got oh, completely oh, destroyed. And it. Look at that. Oh, it's, it's awful. Rubbish. Uh, it's, I might as well throw that away now. <laughs> So we'll compare to the Squire Classic Vibe in purple. If you're, uh, again, haven't seen lots of other videos on our channel, the purple one, it, this is a regular Classic Vibe, but this is a color that normally only Andertons has. Uh, and over here is the Sire T3, yes. uh, which is great. And we'll compare that as well. Yeah. So uh, come on then, Pete, you've got 10 minutes to choose which is your favorite. So I'm, out I'm of in the everything. shop now, just setting yes. it up and trying it out. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm in the Bulgara. So I can get my... Well, I need a bit of gain on that, Absolutely. of course. Absolutely. So, that... the, so this is the... This, that, that's the Bulgara, this is the uh, Katana. Back to the Bulgara. I mean, they're very similar, aren't they? Uh, you know. It's difficult to say if they're similar or not because I'm I sitting a different yeah, way. But well, I was literally just saying, in before we started rolling again, it's it. If you stand ten feet away, yeah, the two amps sound more different than when you're literally sat right on top of them. I kind of feel the 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 katana is a, a softer, um, more mellow kind of tone. Yeah. The Bulgara is a little bit more in your face. Yeah. Um, I mean, you can deep dive into this, but I don't have time to do that. This so. is true. It's not unusual. Uh, okay, so let's so, just... Yeah, I, so, I, I'm assuming on overhead cam or on one of the cameras, you'll be able to see the little red yeah. switcher at Pete's feet. So red for Bulgara, green yeah. for Katana. I, I, it's better than I remember it. Really? Yeah, it's better. Absolutely. It's that weird how you put something in some I, cabinet and then ca cabinetry? I, I was I really like super it. impressed with how much and what's great I think sometimes with these little amplifiers in these kind of videos is getting the volume up a little bit sort of demonstrating them in a way that they're kind of almost designed to be yeah uh, and it's like it's a fabulous sounding it little is, amplifier it is. That. so anyway so moving on so I've got the king of blues here there's two drive settings in that one is kind of a little bit of a low gain Uh, 
It sounds great into the guitar. Already there, that's much more organic. For me, and that is because that doesn't yeah. have any tubes. The minute in it. you put a, a gain pedal into it, all of a sudden well, yes. you start to hear one. It's I remember valvinous. that being better. I remember that being better. Wow. So, but. I mean, like, they'll both work, you know. We, we should say, features wise, yeah. the katana is loaded. Yeah, yeah, with yeah. Features. Oh, inside it, um, everything. Emulated outputs, uh, the ways to link two together. Uh, loads of different effects, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, with so, a little, little but, switcher you can... Yes, but we're just literally comparing clean tones as pedal platforms. This is They're good as well. This both loud, oh. both plenty loud enough for, Absolutely. For, the, for the gig. Second side of the King of Blue. It's a bit more rock, you know, when mm -hmm. you're playing, uh, what's the song? With, uh, with um, Stereophonics. Oh. Was, uh, um, see, I can't remember, it's like 10, 15 years ago now. That whole album of... Uh, it reloaded. Yes. Yeah, but that was the whole comeback, wasn't it? Uh, and here's the katana. Just take a little while to adjust to the sound. It's not worse, it's just. I'm just looking up what song it was, it's annoyed me now. Mama told me not to come, yeah, you're that, absolutely that was... right, was the stereophonics one, so I didn't even need yeah. to look that up. Um. And the one with uh, Nina from uh, The Cardigans. I mean, there's so oh, many good songs. It was on a that. good album, that yeah, wasn't it? Was it? I mean, album. man, how long ago was Sex that? Sex Bomb. 90... 20 years ago? You think it's 90s? I think late 90s, is it? Or early 2000s? So, Reload. We're going to Tom Young's Reload. Man, it makes me feel old. So, Oz wasn't even born probably when this came out. Tom Jones Reload. Reload. It's so good. Didn't he do something with um, Robbie Williams on that album, or am I making that up? I don't up think now? he was on 1999. that. 1999. See? 15 duets. Van Morrison, Keris Matthews, Stereophonics, Robbie Williams. Yeah, oh, yeah caught his head. Yeah. Uh, wow. That was a comeback. That, that was a comeback. You know, that was when, after he had done the Tom Jones show, you know, in America, yeah. wrestling over there, and his son was like, we need something to, to get you back into to gigging and music. And they did that, and it was a great... So, we, anyway, we digress. We digress. We? Uh, so... Can we see some gain stacking? Because obviously, yeah, yeah, you know, so King of Blues and Durples and stuff, you, the whole point is... To have a solo kind of thing. So, you, you know, uh, the Durple is just like... There's something about purple that's just this guitar's flipping good. That's really good. But yes, I would say the Bulgaro sounds better here. So big, big claim. Or should we do a bit of wah first? We need well, to nail we can down do a bit wah, of wah. So we? this, this is like uh, this is one of those things where you put your foot it's like on a it, bat, like the Morley bad horses. Yeah. Isn't it? So as soon as you lift the foot up, a little red light comes on. When you play Kiss, right? Uh, I think we played that in A. Yeah? What was that? Uh, um, what was the whole thing? Bam, bad up, bad up. You have to die. I can't remember. That's that whole. That's the whole uh, thing, right. isn't there? There's a whole like lift. I can't remember. But... 
I mean, it's, it's Scott McKeown shouting out the chords to you yeah, from yeah, behind yeah. your screen. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, yeah, but this is good, man. <laughs> he's, the, he's the right one for that gig now. He is. That's it. He's in the great guitar player. Anyway, uh, so, yeah, that's good. It's good. I mean, the other one has got a... Should we try um, this, 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 uh, Vailton, Yeah, we can do, we can um, do. Doodah, excuse me a second while I just... I mean, there's more functions in this one, isn't there? Oh, it's tons of stuff on that, but... I don't know if you'd need all that, but anyway, this is super small. Uh, I can't I think you have to stomp on it to engage the wire, otherwise yep, so, it's volume. So now, yeah. it's, so you could potentially go a little bit... Of, not that I'm going to use that, but, and then... I prefer that. So the problem I, I think with, the, with any of those wah pedals that engage as you stand on them, yeah. if your natural action is to kind of go back and All let the, the wah switch off, yeah. it's like the effect is going off, on, off, on. Yeah. Whereas with you know a when conventional wah, where you have to push on the toe to put it on, you, yeah. you just get this natural... Ah, it's horses for courses, right? And then you've got the upside and then the volume as well, if you want. And there's a volume. Uh, yeah. I think okay. I'll go with that. And you might have noticed on the on the thing there, actually, I didn't go over. You did The budget. I that I was know. when we went into the uh, the, there was the some savings, basket. I saved there? on yes. my on my power supplies. Uh, anyway, so I got an angel wing there. Just for you know, sometimes you know. What did we play then? I can't remember anymore now, it's so long ago, but I'm sure there was something with the chorus and you know, you add it on and it's just nice to have it, you know. It's there uh, and it's great, uh, so why not? And then the bucket brigade delay. Just when you're so good. Yeah. Oh, we're in this now, you're by the way. You're still in the. Yeah, in yeah. The, yeah, I know. Uh, here's the other one. I mean, any of those two amps will do, really, you know. I do like, I prefer that. Uh, it's just off the bat, I must no, admit. Look, but, that's fine. So, uh, okay, we've got to narrow guitars down. Guitars. We need to narrow guitars down. Yeah, so let's just... I mean, you, I've been playing this now. Oh, I yes, know you, so you have. turned it down. Exactly, see? see? Why didn't you um, use your foot on that? So these are exactly the same price. So same this is price. A, this is a nice Slightly comparison. different kind of vibe. So that so the um, Sire has a satin neck. Similar yeah. kind of carve, but satin. A yeah. little bit more of a contoured body yeah. uh, on the back. Yeah. And from a previous video that we've done, um, slightly fatter sounding pickups. But let, let's see so let's whether see. that's better or worse. I'll turn my volume up, shall I? A little bit fatter, fatter. not mm. so defined, not so a little bit... Um... I mean, nice guitar, nice roll boards and all that stuff. Maybe it's the, um, maybe it's the board, maybe it's the... I mean, we know with the clean sounds, let's just have a bit of a... something with that when it gets too much gain it get, becomes a little bit fizzy let's try this i'm just i almost need like a just a g chord back to back yes back to back that was a danish band actually back to back That's, that's, Nothing in it, that's also, 
I think the only reason... It's almost psychological. Why did I think it's... That? Oh, are the OGs coming out The now. one that's broken. Okay, right. I tell you what, no talking now, Pete. Just okay. literally bam, bam. That one, this one, this one. Okay. And then discuss. You ready for this? I'm, 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 I'm all, all through the Bagheera with no pedals. Yes, okay. Right? okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, the strings on that one is definitely from yesteryear because it's been uh, on holiday somewhere. But um, I can't. I I, I think. I tell you and what, Also, shut, because it's right. purple. Shut your eyes. Give me all three guitars, <laughs> and, you, and you tell me which one you think is which. Well, I can tell because so, that one's got a satin. No, neck no, no. I'll, I'm going to play. You shut oh, your you eyes. Gonna, okay. You shut your eyes, and you tell me which one you think is which sound-wise. Okay. Sounds like my bed. <laughs> Keep your eyes shut. Which one then? That's it, there's three guitars. Can I open up? No, 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 because then you'll see okay. which one I'm holding. So um, just tell me which one you thought was which. The first one was the... It's impossible. I honestly cannot tell. <laughs> it's just stupid. Um, uh, Sire, Squire, Fender. Wow. Nailed it. Nailed it. Really? Yeah. yeah. Interestingly, I thought in terms of the sort of spectrum of tonality. Yeah. The Squire's the brightest and snappiest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think a lot of that is to do with maybe brand new strings, lacquered fretboard. Yeah. Maybe the brightest pickups as yeah, well. Yeah. As in, and it's got a set of nine gauge yeah, on it. And then probably the Sire just sound, I mean, his apologies, the Sire was very slightly out of tune, which was annoying, but the Sire had the more, the mellowest That's tone. what put me off and I then, thought it might be this one. Yeah, and then this one was just sort of in the middle. Yeah. But, but, it, but, it's, but it's got, it's got more harmonies in that guitar. There's more, there's just a right. bit, I feel, I felt like that was a bit, there was a bit more in it. Wow. Well, where, look, where okay, so, um, I, I'll, just, and also because it's my purple, I would go with that one. Wow, yeah. fair enough, man. Because well, look, I think so, I'd stand out a bit more in the, in the, um, you'd certainly, people would go, oh, look, it's Dan, it's the man with the purple Telecaster. Yeah, in the He's background, saying, yes. you can't see who he is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, well look. Um, well, there we go. I mean, I so would have a look. Final, prepared, but... final, final decision. You, yeah. which, which amp? I'll probably go Bugera on this one. Okay, so Bugera amplifier. And it's cheaper. Is it's it cheaper slightly cheaper? Price check. So that's three four nine. You might have blown your budget by a bit. I then. might have blown my oh, budget you know by what? going that. We're all friends here. Um, fine. So yeah. three. So okay. So the Bugera is slightly more expensive. I take that back. So, but. It will roughly ish. We're still in the right ballpark. Yeah. I mean, any um, of the, any of these two will do absolutely fine. You might have to come back and do a, a video for free or something like that if we're letting you off the twenty quid extra. Yeah. So. Can I keep the amp too then? <laughs> <laughs> so all right. Uh, yeah, but it's good, man. There's your pedal board, I mean, right? There's a pedal Volume board wire on the Bailton. Yeah. Loads of overdrive options there. Yeah. Chorus delay. Chorus delay. Everything. I mean, I haven't even set it up to do to do anything. I can I can fiddle with it all day long. Play us you know? out. And Mr. how much Pete. was that then? Is it about a thousand pounds for everything? It? For everything. That's a good yeah. price, isn't it? Yep. Anyway, I think that's enough, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. Thank I can't you very remember much for any of these songs anymore. Uh, please like and subscribe. Tons of other content on this channel. Um, and yeah, oh, it's interesting. I'll put links like below it. for all the products yes, that we that. showed in this video. Uh, yeah, you better get to the gig. Going to be late. Yeah, yeah. My car's broken down now as well, so it's all right. Can we'll I pause my taxi? <laughs>